We were thinking horror and Randonautica just brought us to this. Are you okay? What happened? Okay, just stay, stay. What happened? I think I literally fractured my tailbone. My camera's not doing justice to it, but, but those are dolls. Yeah, those are dolls everywhere. Why are they here? I don't know. I'm Mo Sargent. That's how we do it. I travel the world to seek out haunted and abandoned places to document the unknown for your entertainment needs. Go, go, go. Careful. From abandoned ghost towns hide to, right now. to being locked up in the basement of haunted mansions. Those ghosts, your spirits, were telling her, build this, build this. To fighting for my survival on deserted islands. And when I'm not pissing off demons in haunted mental asylums, I'm exploring underwater caves and using giant magnets to find treasures. Ah, we lost the ah! Subscribe to my crazy life to become a part of the adventures. Yo, top, my boy! Live a little. What's up guys, I'm Osarji. Welcome back to another Random Nautica adventure. Hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I am about to give you guys a Random Nautica adventure. Um, you guys really want these adventures and I'm gonna keep delivering these adventures to you guys. So, I brought Rennie with me today. It's a winter wonderland. It is a winter wonderland Random Nautica adventure. It's not and I have Jimmy with me. Hey, you guys haven't seen Jimmy in a very, very long time. Now, I asked you guys on Twitter to give me some intentions. I just got hit with a snowball. Who did that? I asked you guys on Twitter to give me your intentions, basically for Ren and Nautica, so we can ask it things and things that came from you guys. So keep commenting on my social medias, on Instagram and on Twitter, and uh, let me know what other future intentions we should check out. So we're gonna go ahead and use the intentions that you guys gave us on Twitter, but let's get inside away from all the snow because I don't want the camera to get wet. Before we move on to today's video, I want you guys to know that the new Mosarji Motivated Merch Edition is live and you guys can get it. The link is down below. Go get it. Once you guys get yourself the merch, make sure to send me photos of you wearing it. Even send CJ photos of you guys wearing it so we can share it on our platforms. Make sure you guys get the Motivator merch. The link is down below. Now let's get on with this Random Nautica adventure. Okay, so I got my post from Twitter. If you're not following me on Twitter, follow me at Mosarji because I'll be sharing your intentions from Twitter. So it's kind of like a little shout out to you guys. Anyways, I asked you guys on Twitter, give me some intentions. Someone said, oh yes. Um, another person, Chrissy Shepard said, Rituals. We have we done rituals before? I think we have. We have. Huh? Let's see I how creative have. you guys are. Let's see if you should try a Ouija board for an intent. I don't see how a Ouija board for an intent would work out. Something Christmassy. Tis the season. Maybe. That's a maybe. Um. Ooh, that's a good one. What, what? Krampus. Oh yeah, yeah. Ooh, that's a good one. That's, we, like, we that's might, like the dark Santa Claus. We version, might do right? that yeah. one. Crime scene, bloodbath, death. We've done death before. <laughs> we found a crime scene. We found a grave in the last video that yeah, we true, filmed. Yeah. If you guys didn't see that, the link is going to be down below. Aliens is a good one. I like that one, actually. Yeah. Aliens. Okay. And someone said shawarma. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to pick aliens. Someone said aliens. Okay. I'm going to pick aliens. That's going to be my intention. That's That comes from Brandy Renee. So thank you for your intention. Um, I like that one. What are you going to think? I'm going to go with the Krampus one. Krampus. Jimmy. Krampus. Krampus as well. Okay. okay, okay. Alright, here we go. Let's go ahead and generate. Remember guys, comment your next intentions on my Twitter, so I'll see you guys on my Twitter. And here we go. Three, Remember, two, Jimmy, one. Channel, channel Krampus. You gotta think of it in your head. Think of it. Okay, I'm gonna start thinking about aliens. Three, two, one. Thinking, thinking, thinking. Alright, now we wait. Prepare to embark on your journey. Well, this is taking forever. Focus on your intention. There we go. We got a point. Void power anomaly. Our journey. Let's go see where it's taking us. Open in Google Maps. There we go. Three, two, one. It's not too far away. Starting route. All right, let's Proceed do it. I'm not 100% sure what the heck we're going to find. This place is only two minutes away, it's saying. And I was thinking aliens. You guys were thinking what? Krampus. Krampus. Both of us were, so we had double the intention. Yo, if we find like a Krampus outside, like an actual figure of Krampus, yeah. I'm going to freak out. Yeah. Like straight up. Turn left. All right, so I'm not sure. We just say Krampus, Christmassy things, you know? Yeah, well, I mean, obviously it's December, so. <gasps> what, what, what? What the f*** is that? Oh my god! <laughs> what is this? It's Krampus! Thing? That's a Krampus! <laughs> that is a fing Krampus! <laughs> There's no way! That is Shash. a yeti! That is a yeti! That's not Krampus, but. But holy shit, what are the odds of that? <laughs> it's not Krampus, but it's a scary Christmas freaking. Monster. There, 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 there's little Santa Claus, and that's his. Uh, that's not an alien. I think it's Big Yeti, Yeti sidekick. His legs are mutated. I think that's Yeti. <laughs> his legs are what? Jimmy mutated. <laughs> I think that was Yeti, not Krampus. 
but that was pretty cool. The fact that it brought us here and we were thinking Krampus. Let's move on to the next location. All right, back to my Twitter comments for the next intention. We have someone here named Jesse and 1800s. 1800s. What could okay. possibly, what could Ren Nautica possibly generate for the 1800s? Have you ever done that before? Have you ever thought like of a no. time period? No. 1800s or Wild West is what she said. Or Wild West? Yeah. Okay, fine. I'll think 1800s. You guys can think Wild West. You thinking Wild West, Jimmy? I'm thinking Wild West. All right, All right let's do it. Three, two, one. Here we go. Generating. 1800s, 1800s, 1800s. Give me something old, baby. Give me something old like gold. Oh, it'd be nice. Ooh, gold something. rush. Make sure you guys comment down below what kind of attentions you guys um, want to see us do next. Um, leave them in the comments of this video. All right, we got our point. It's about 10 minutes away from here. Start journey. All right, Belly Bob. Let's do it. I'm hoping we're gonna find something wild west. Starting route. That'd be cool. <laughs> Let's do it. South. Go kiss him. Go kiss him, Rennie. Rennie wants to kiss Santa Claus. Hurry up before the guy comes out with a shotgun. Rennie's gonna make out with Santa Claus right now. Oh, Rennie, you're a disgusting. Oh my god, he hurt himself. <laughs> run, Rennie, run. On to the next location. It shows that we should be here. All I see is a campsite. Another dead end place, no idea. Yeah, look, it's a dead end. There's nothing here. I've never even been here before. Oh, looky, looky. I see a train. That's a 1800s train. That's right. I don't know about you, but that's as wild west as it gets, boys and girls. No, seriously? I know. <laughs> what the f was that? I gotta get down there. There's no way. Well, this is kind of weird. We just stumbled upon a train. It's like an 1800s train, maybe even older than that. Is there a date on that? If this right says 1800, there's usually dates yeah, on these things. Hold on. Limited. So it's the engine number here. Engine number? There's got to be a date. Yo, there's got to be an actual date here somewhere. Oh, this, is legit. this is so cool, this guys. Legit. Look at this train. <laughs> there's got to be a date, though. I'm like really interested yeah. in finding a date on this. It just says 357, but I don't think that's the date. Look at that gauge. Has a date up there. Nah, there's no, there's no date it's on this thing. London, Ontario. Wow. Careful, Renny. So, Random Nautica just brought us to this old creepy train. You said it came from London, Ontario? Yeah, it says up there on the gauge. Limited. Oh, what the f***? Hey, did you lose your cell phone? No. There's a cell phone here. Just construction there, guys. Sorry about the noise. There's a cell phone here. Jimmy, did you lose your cell phone? Nope. Where? Someone left a cell phone here. Look. Oh, shit. Wait, what does this say? Wait. No. That's a clue, guys. This is a f clue from... Oh! <gasps> It says rando! Look, it says rando up top! No, Look. no you're right. R A N D O. D O. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And there's a cell phone. Take phone. a cell phone. Take a cell phone. Do I want to take a cell phone? I don't know. Take it. It's not It's not uncommon to find cell phones in rando. A lot of people that do video, these videos online, they always find cell phones. Does it turn on? Oh, it's dead. Oh, we have to find a charger. This is a really old phone. It won't turn on, huh? We have to find a charger and see what's on this thing. Random Nautica just brought us to this really creepy oh, old it. train. This opens. What? It opens? Oh. Hello? Anything in there? Yeah, that's creepy. So, you had the phone? I got the phone. So, Random Nautica literally just brought us to a damn train. A really old train. And then we find a phone. Hey, didn't we find a... F Me and Angelo, a long time ago, we found a phone while we were doing Random Nautica live. But we were on the French side of Canada. Okay. It was all mangled and destroyed though. We never got were a chance- to turn it on though? No. That's why we never did anything about it. But maybe if we can get a charger for this one, we'd have to go somewhere and buy a charger. This one's dead. So maybe at the end of the video, we'll get a charger and we'll see what's on that phone. On to the next location. Okay, so we are gonna grab another intention from the Twitter feed over here. Someone said gold. Gold, gold would be cool to find. That'd be awesome. Gold would be cool to find. Murder, regret. I don't know what that's all about. Um, someone said horror. All right, let's go with horror. You guys know Random Nautica is basically controlled by strange people from the black dark web. 
You can go with horror. I'm going with gold. What about you, Jimmy? I'm going to go with horror. Someone said best child memory as well. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go with horror, which is comes from Sarah Grace Grubb. And uh, let's do it. Let's generate Renanautica. Horror. <laughs> we got our generate. We got our point. Start journey. Let's go. Forty three minutes away. Oh damn, that's actually far. Forty three minutes away from here. Who's up for a road trip? Starting route to two seventy nine Groton Road. All right, so not Eddie Stormredo Heights Lane. Not then even, turn not, right not even joking. Prince of Wales Shut up. Drive. Not even joking, guys. It's uh, 42 minutes away. So, See? yeah. Oh, jeez. 42 minutes away. So we've been driving for like 15, 20 minutes. We wouldn't be driving so long if you knew which exit to take. I made a mistake on an exit. I'm sorry. I don't know where the hell this thing's taking us. We still have 27 minutes, 42 kilometers as of right now. It's 3.06 p.m. It says we're going to get there at 3.33. So hopefully we find something um, relating to our intentions. What was our intentions again? Horror. You were, you were thinking horror, and I was thinking gold. Gold. And Jimmy was thinking the same thing as you. Horror, gold. Okay. Yeah. I mean, hopefully there's something there. We shall see. There's a very, very strange car back there that's been following us. Look, look, it's right behind me. Look, look. I've noticed it. It's been following us. Jimmy, you see it? It's like a Honda Accord type thing. What about, what about it though? I, I've noticed it like since we were at the train. It's almost like someone's following us. It's hitting the gas now. It's slowing down every since I turned around. Yeah, that's scary. I just I'm worried because with these like dark web people, they do follow. Wait, wait, wait. You, right you think somebody's following us? Jump in the right lane. Maybe if he follows us there. I don't know. We'll keep an eye on them. How, how long? Have you since noticed that they're at the train? I just I pay attention. Oh, he's you know speeding that. up. He's speeding up. Is he? Okay, yeah, we'll just keep an eye on him. He's not doing anything weird right now. It's just I've noticed him since the train, and we're we're a long way from that train. Yeah, we are. We're in an area called Brigadoon. Never heard of this place. South Prescott. So we've driven quite some way to get out here. I don't think I don't think I've ever been here before. That car that we thought was following us, it got off the same exit that we got off, but it didn't follow us down this road. It went the opposite way. Could have been just nothing. But it was following us for like 30 minutes, so. Yeah, and like everywhere we were turning, it, it literally followed. Even when I took the wrong exit, it took the wrong exit with me. That's what made me feel like it was following us, you yeah. know what I mean? Because we ended up doing another U-turn. That would be a very going like. Back south. Proceed to the route. I don't know what's going on with this GPS. We're literally all the way out here in the middle of nowhere. It keeps like re, re-changing. Yeah. And now it's time to do a U-turn, which is strange. U-turn to where though? I didn't see any place that we. It said turn left, but there was no rope back yeah, there. I didn't see Proceed anything to either. the route. Proceed Red to the route. where are you taking us? Let's do a U-turn over here. Proceed to the route. Okay. Well, okay, we get the point. This is scary. <laughs> <laughs> well, we are literally out in the middle of like nowhere. This, this, is, this is the boondocks here. So what do you expect that we're gonna find here? You were thinking horror. What are you gonna expect to see? A dead animal. Yeah. With our luck, we'll probably find a dead animal. Hey, Jimmy, what do you think we're gonna see out here? Something. You were thinking the same thing as Mo. You were thinking horror. Oh. What? I know where we are. Dude. Look, hey, look, 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 skeleton. I know. Did you see that? Hold on, I'm slipping. Is that an animal over there? That's how long it took me to break. Dude, look at this. Back up, though. Look at the, the mailbox. Mm, what the hell? Oh, look wait. at the mailbox. Yo, we, oh, yeah. we, we said horror? Look at that. <laughs> give, me, give me the other camera. Okay, okay. We were thinking horror and Randonautica just brought us to this this house with skeletons everywhere. Not only that, turn the camera to the left. Look at the mailbox. Mailbox? Oh, yeah, you're right. Jeez. Holy shit. That was weird. That is... But here, I've been here before, though. Oh, you guys don't understand why we're here. Look at you. You don't even know what's about to happen right uh -huh. now. Look look up ahead. What? Look at that. What? What? what look. Is this? What the oh. heck? 
Look oh, at this. Look how many there are. Random Nautica just brought us to the My camera's not doing justice. To the to doll forest. Those are dolls. Yeah, those are dolls everywhere. Why are they here? My camera's not doing justice to it, but, but those are dolls. Yeah, those are dolls everywhere. Why are they here? I don't know. Hey, look at this. Oh, that's so cool. There's a bunch of deer over there. They're coming towards us. Whoa. Okay, they're pretty far away. So we got some deers right there. I mean, I did say dead animals. <laughs> they're not dead yet, okay. Okay, so we just... So I've been here before. I did a vlog a little while ago um, in the summertime, which is why I didn't recognize this place. I came through here in the summertime and I seen these dolls. I just showed them to you guys briefly. I don't know anything about them. I don't know why they're here, but look at this. There's like probably a thousand dolls. Holy crap. Who made this though? Like the owner? I think it is the owner. I don't know why, but Randonautica just literally brought us to the doll forest. Whoa. Yeah, yeah, but this this is way more. This is creepier. But why did it bring us here? Is there anything like, you know, it said horror, but is there anything else that can indicate Random Nautica did this here? Like this is this is crazy, man. Like look at these things. Yeah, and, and and I feel like I feel like there's more dolls than when I first came here. The first time there's yeah, definitely more dolls they, they definitely added to it so i'm having a, a hard time understanding why random nautica brought us out here there's a trail down that way that i've never been i don't know if we can go on it but we should maybe walk down the trail and see if we can find it yeah it's cold but hey if we drove all the way out here so we might as well right because we can't actually go onto this property it says no trespassing the owner lives right over there and yeah i can only imagine what this person has in their house <laughs> like look what they have outside imagine what they have inside So we're walking down this trail. Did you guys see that? It was like something glowing back there. Like it flew, like I seen it at the end of the trail and there was something glowing over there. I don't know what it was. Oh, oh, oh shit, shit. Are you okay? What happened? Are you okay? What happened? Okay, just stay, stay. What happened? I think I literally fractured my tailbone. Really? That was a hard slip. Careful. That was a really bad fall. Shit. Okay, just take it easy. What do you want? Tell me what you want. Oh, fuck. Fuck, if Randy Nautica's not gonna kill us, the ice will. That was a really hard hit. Yeah, it was. Jeez. And I, I almost fell over there and I feel I felt it on my back. That hurt. Yeah, it sounded like it hurt. Like, Renny just took the biggest fall ever over here. So don't walk in the, don't walk in the trails because it's all ice. So we're finding all these, like, tracks. They're not human. I think they're the, those deers that we saw earlier. Did you say you saw them before? I saw, like, something shiny. Like a big exactly orb. what I saw. What, you just saw it? Like, something glint, like shiny. Really? Yeah. Just now? Yeah, yeah. Where, like, down that way? Straight ahead. Literally straight ahead. I seen something shiny. I don't know what it was, though. Okay, so what the hell was it then? I don't know. It was like car. <laughs> Randonautica, what do you want us to do? What do you want us to do? It's getting much, much colder out. It's snowing. It's kind of cool to see, but I just... I think we're just wasting our time here. We should probably head back to the house and go to the dollar store or something and get a charger for that phone. I'd really like to see what's on that phone. It's an old phone. It's not broken. The last one we found uh, almost a year ago it was broken, so we couldn't even start it up. But this one, I think if we find a charger, we might be able to start it up. So, you know, I don't know. You guys seen anything? No. How long do you think this trail goes for? I mean, it go, if I, I looked at the GPS and it goes long, so I don't even think we should keep walking this. What's wrong? Shining on that side now. Shining? Yeah, what do you mean shining? shining. Like, uh, like something glistening. What do you mean? Right there towards the left. 
Like he saw it moving? Like something just glistening like Can you zoom in maybe? Cuz cuz when I when I saw whatever it was, when I saw what it, whatever it was, it was around this area, but there's nothing here, but I seen it moving. It was like a bright flashy orb from a distance. Yeah. What did you see? Something shiny. Like imagine like the sun catching yeah. on exactly. something and reflecting yeah. it off. Let's go back. Let's go back. Let's go back and get a charger and charge up that phone that we found and see what's on it. I want to know if you guys have had any Randonautica experiences if um, and what they were. Let me know in the comments below. Have you tried Randonautica? Have you done anything related to this? And what kind of things happened to you? Here, what? It was around here. I don't see nothing. You said you saw it on the left side. Yeah, yeah. Well, I don't see anything. There's nothing here. Huh? This, what? This is what, we must have seen. what is that? What the f is that? Don't touch it. Hold on. What is that? Oh, what the hell? What is that? It's a skull. Holy f that explains it though. But I see. That's, that's what but what I saw, it was moving. I saw something moving. It was shiny. That's shiny. Did you see anything move though when you saw it? Jim? No, I, no, I didn't see anything. Listening. Yeah, same. I just saw like the glistening, like. It's not sunny. Oh, look what's written on the tree. <gasps> Randonautica, we are watching. It literally says Randonautica, we are watching on the tree. And there's a f***ing skull right above it. Is there, a, is there a camera in that skull? Here, hold this. Jimmy, just, just look around. It's heavy. Dude, look at this. No, I, I look see. Look at this thing. Shit. It's completely empty. Rando Nautica, we are watching. Yeah, it says that on the tree. How did we not see that when we walked by? Guys, just just take a look around. Do you see anything? Is there like literally a person just watching us? But hey, I seen something glowing, like kind of flying. Like literally moving. That's what I saw. And you said you seen an orb kind of like that too. I didn't see an orb. I saw just something shiny in the distance. Yeah, and that, 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 that. It looked like an orb. But it must have been this. Here, there's a skull here. This is weird. You, this is crazy. I have a feeling someone's watching. That's me. what I mean. That's why I'm like, let's take a look around because there might be somebody watching us. There? What? You guys see that? Where? Is that a car? Oh, what is that? Is that wait, wait, here. Give me, give me the camera. Give me the camera. There's so. No, I seen something on the trail. What is that? I've been looking that way. There was nothing there. No, that's my truck. I'm eager to see what's on that on that phone that we found. I don't think I want to take this. I think we should just leave this. Yeah, because like it's not mine, first of all, to take. So let's just leave that up there. That was very strange that we found that there. All right, so we are going to get the hell out of here. We're leaving the skull right there where we found it. No foot tracks going to the tree. So that must have been put there a while ago. Let's head back. Let's go and get a charger for that phone and see what's on it. There might be some clues to what the heck is going on. It makes sense of everything, right? Benny, I think you guys were right. There was a car there just now. I s oh shit. I seen someone running to a car and getting in and starting it up. It's almost like we were being watched. Oh, there it is. There it is, there it is. That's, I seen, there was someone watching us. Okay, we need to get the f out of here. We need to get the f out. What? There's like a black figure over there. All the way to the end. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's go. We are back to my house now. It was a long ass drive. Um, it's funny, but we the same car literally followed us on the highway on the way back home. We didn't get it on camera because my battery died on this camera and we only we only brought one battery with us. It was just strange. Like we left the area, that car followed us on the highway again, and then it left after we got back onto the exit to come back home. So we have the phone. This is the phone that we found in the snow. And uh, it won't start up. We've been trying to get it to start. We actually went to the dollar store and bought, bought a cord because it takes the old school. This is an iPhone 4, I guess. And it's in decent condition, like it's in mint condition. And it won't, it just won't start. I don't know if this phone has anything to do with Randonautica, which is why we're trying to start it up. I mean, 
what are the odds of finding a phone on the train? You know, yeah. it has to do something with well, random. Well, it said rando in the snow. Yeah, it said rando in the snow. And like 100% this belongs to whoever is in charge at Randonautica. Jimmy, do you think your friend though can get the phone? Yeah, yeah definitely. Well, he's going to probably have to fix the right in there where the charger plugs in. Yeah. Because it keeps restarting, restarting nonstop. So we kind of s- saw it start up like for a brief second. And we seen like a dog. Yeah, yeah well, we and saw like their screen page or whatever, and it was a dog. Yeah. yeah, it was a dog for like a brief second, and then it shut off instantly. And now this is what's happening. It just like I'm trying to get this thing to work. All we keep getting is this stupid Apple sign. So I don't know. I don't know what this means. Like, is this dog? Did they did they kill another animal or something? Or I don't know. Um, like, it'd be nice to get this thing to start, but it just it just won't. Did you get it? We tried a different plug, but look now the Apple logo stays on. Yeah, try not moving the charger port. It might be messed up too. Oh look. Yeah, yeah, I think it's working. It, if I'm holding the charger port in, it stays in tighter. <gasps> you got it. Yeah, see, that's what we were talking about. You see the dog? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, right there. Okay, so Wednesday, December thirty-first. What's the date? Mm, today's what the 19th today's the 19th the 20th, yeah. it's the 20th. literally the 19th 20th yeah. okay no the 20th yeah today's december tw- december 20th yeah, yeah december 20th it's 5 33 it's not 7 and look look it's funny because it says 100 percent charged but the second you take the 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 cord away there's, on a, purpose. there's a passcode so we can't unlock this how many tries did we get you think with the passcode like 10 tries i don't know but i think it locks you out for an hour if you get it wrong Try too many times number one three seven nine one, three, seven, nine. Nope. Oh, you guys aren't going to get it like One, that. One, two, three, four. Oh, it disabled us. It yeah. disabled us. So we, we can't even find out what's on this phone. I mean, for all we know, somebody left their phone out there, right? No. But I, I no, I, I doubt it. Because they broke random the in the that snow. It turns off every time you take the charger off. I feel like that was done on purpose. Yeah. I don't know what to do with this random Nautica phone. You guys let me know in the really? comments below. We're going to go ahead and end off this video. Jimmy's got to go home. And uh, Renny's got to go home as well. And I got to give it to my wife. Hope you guys enjoyed today's adventure. Smash the like button. Comment down below what you want us to do for the next one. Um, anything you guys want, we'll try to do the intentions and hopefully we'll get something better than today's video. We got a lot of cool stuff on today's video. Wasn't expecting to find a train. Wasn't expecting it to take us to the uh, doll forest. I also wasn't expecting it, wasn't expecting to see a big Yeti. Hey Elsa. Smash the like button. Don't forget to get yourself some motivated merch. Get all the merch. The links are down below. And uh, yeah, I want to see each and every one of you guys wearing the merch. So once you do, once you get the merch, make sure to send me photos so I can give you guys a shout out.